Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So as you can see we are doing a massive Etsy sticker haul today and this is like three weeks worth of stickers and I'm thinking of doing my hauls more like this where they are bigger sticker hauls just because I'm trying to split up my Wednesday videos and not just do hauls for you guys. So definitely you know, get a snack or be prepared for a long video because we have lots of things to go through. But the first two orders I have here are from Scribble Prince Co. I have my mystery kit and then a, just like an order from her shop. So we'll do the order last or like next. Um, but this was her mystery kit for May and I'm super excited about it. So this is the post-it notes, which I think are really, really pretty. I really like the like black with the accent of the palm tree, but then the kit is just as amazing. So it's um, all beach themed and all that good stuff. So you have the freebie right on top and then the um, other freebie for this month was the scribblers with um, like the surfboard and in hula skirts and so you get two of each character and you have all six of the girls on there and then she did have the glitter headers this month instead of doing like the full glitter sheet she had just the glitter headers and then this is the kit it is her ultimate style kit but you just have um like your deco and icon sheet and it's just black green and then two tan colors and I think it's perfect and I really like the like geometric well not really geometric but like tribal patterns that she chose and then you have all your boxes and your check boxes um, your little things and then your um, full boxes as well as your bottom washi which I really like how simple it is and I love this full box and then the last freebie were these girls and um, she was saying that you could like do them together or do these two together so that you have the different prints in the bathing suit but I believe the way that I planned everything for June I'm actually using this kit for the week that I graduate um, which is fitting because um, like that's when my summer starts so I'm super excited to use this and I really like um, how it all looks. Um, I was really worried when I first saw it about like the colors. I don't know, I'm not a very big green person, but once I saw it like all together, I was really, really excited. So the next order that I have is, I believe this is called her coffee kit, but I don't know what it is about me, but I've been recently really wanting to just change everything. <laughs> and like, I don't know. I'm, I'm just in a funk, I guess, you guys, but um, this is her new little, like, card thing that she sends. But then I got the Harper freebie, which is the girl that I think looks most like me, so that's pretty exciting, so there's that. And then, um, so like I said, the coffee kit, and so I got the purse, well, here, we'll go through the simple stuff first. I got the sheet of fashion girls um and the reason why I got these I normally wouldn't get these just because I'm not like super into the full boxes or whatever you know I am happy that she sized them down to be smaller I think that's a really good idea but I did pick that up as well as the glitter sampler because I got the personal kit and I think I'm going to use this in my inserts or I might do a mock plan with me I did get a um was it hula? Yeah, I did get her hula um, personal kit, and then on that one I just got the glitter sampler, so one of them I'm going to do a mock spread with in my Erin Condren, and then the other one I'm going to do in my inserts, but I really liked the colors in this, and especially the dog, um, so I'm excited to give that a try, and like I was saying, I've just been really into trying out different things, which is good for you guys, because maybe it's entertaining, um, <laughs> but... Yeah, be on the lookout for that. Like I said, one of them I'm going to use in my, like, my inserts probably during the summer when um, I go back to doing, like, normal plans in there as opposed to school plans. But, yeah, definitely be on the lookout for that. So then this is my PR package from JV Planning. So, um, 
yeah, let's get into this. I'll start with this one. So if you watched my giveaway video, you've already seen this kit, but it's the Life is Sweet kit, and I'm obsessed with this. Everyone and their mom came out with a kit with this clip art, but I'm really glad that JB Planning did it. As you guys know, she's one of my favorites. So you have your nine full boxes, and she gives two different skin colors of the girl. You have all your check lists, boxes, and headers, and this bottom washi is gorgeous, um, but like sidebar stuff, and then you have like all your functional things and your date cover-ups, little things, all the same format washi and deco and all that good stuff. So that is the first kit that she sent, and this kit is still available in her shop. I do have my PR code linked down below for you guys, so definitely use that. I believe it's 15% off, um, but normally when she comes out with new releases and whatnot, she does have um, coupon codes and stuff like that, so definitely follow her on uh, Instagram so you get all those notifications, and follow me because I post most of her stuff too. Um, anyway, uh, let's do this last or next but she also sent me some of her llamas and she does have her penguin character but now she's come out with this llama character and I'm obsessed with this llama character I just went and bought a ton more from her but this one is Lily the llama drinks coffee and they're super teeny tiny and I love the size of them they're going to be super easy to put on like a little label sticker but then she also gave me the flying unicorn llamas and I think they're so cute I don't know what I'm going to use these for but I'm almost out of my happy munchkin so I think these might replace those but those are Lily the llama she has a ton of other activities uh, that the llama's doing and I picked up some of those that were applicable to me but she has a ton more of her penguins and then now the llamas and then this last kit is her mini me kit and I think this was exclusive to all of her PR girls just because when we got this it was pretty close to Mother's Day um, but I will be doing a mock spread with this next Wednesday to kind of uh, like post plan my Mother's Day week and kind of try out a different uh, a different layout but let me just show you it's the same format but I thought I'd just show you guys because um, I do hauls and whatnot I thought it would be good to just show you guys what came in my PR package but like I was saying definitely go check out her shop and the life is sweet um, kit will be up but this one won't be because I believe it was just um for her PR girls. But that is what I got from JD Planning. I feel like every single time I do a haul, I have an order from her. And I'm not complaining because I love her stickers. <laughs> but that's JB Planning. And then I have the Coffee Monsters Co. And I don't know why, but I've just been really into her stickers and I I needed more. So let's open this up. And I have been collecting my beans, so I now have another one of these, but I did take all of the beans off of the sheets that I got. So here's the freebie on top, and I love all the little emojis. I like when they put, um, like, Once More With Love, she puts uh, munchkins that are very, like, applicable to everyone. I think that's a smart idea. But I did get more boba stickers because I'm, like, almost out of my munchkin boba stickers, so I needed some more. And then I got some Chipotle stickers because I realized that I go to Chipotle a lot and it would probably be better to mark what I actually get, like, bowls and chips and all that other stuff as opposed to using, like, taco stickers when I don't get tacos. <laughs> um, and then I did get more of her therapy stickers. And then I got three of her play buttons because I thought that planning roses discontinued hers but just as I bought these and just as I got them in the mail she restocked her play buttons so now I'm gonna have both of them but it's fine both of them work perfectly and you can never have too many when you use as many as I do in a week so there's that and then next I have my what's it called glam planner mystery subscription and I'm kind of bummed out well no I'm not really bummed out but I am gonna use this later in the month because it is a birthday sorry I said later in the month I meant later in the year <laughs> I'm gonna use it in August for my friend's birthday but it is a birthday themed kit and so I'm gonna use this for my friend's birthday as I said which is in August so I did have to figure out a little bit of like what I was gonna do for my person one of my personal spreads this month but it kind of worked out for you guys because now I'm just gonna do a leftover spread which I'm excited about but anyways so I do get her personal sized um, what's it called? 
personal size kit and I really love this full box right here because there's marbling in the back and I think it's super cool but I really love this blue and this teal color and this is not really pink it's kind of more of a red so I'm super excited about this but it's the same format she hasn't changed anything I really love this weekly box and then there is the double box down there and then you have all of the beautiful deco and more half boxes and whatnot. So definitely we'll be using this in August, but that's why you won't be seeing a glam planner spread in my inserts this month, just because I don't have a birthday this month. Um, at least not like in the later weeks now. <laughs> so definitely we'll be saving that. But that is the monthly kit from Glam Planner. And now I have my Planning Roses order. And these were her June pre-sales. And I didn't see, like, none of the kits I really, like, fell in love with. So I just picked up the June, um, the June monthly. So I did get the, like, circle for the, um, like, page before the notes page just to match. I really enjoy those. And then this is the June kit, and I went with the palm pattern, which I believe was her, like, floral option. Um, I go back and forth all the time, and I was so happy to see that she still had this freebie. She had this one in the last order that I got, so I was very excited about that. But same format. She has been talking about changing up her format to include a few more things, so I'm very excited about that. Um, but it does have a longer strip up here that has a quote in it, and it's kind of cool she added in a beach day. Probably won't go to the beach just because where I live, summer is crazy when you go to the beach. It's just, it's not that great, and the beaches aren't that clean, so I'm just, like, not into it, but, oh, I mean, you never know, so we'll see, we'll see. But that is the June monthly kit. I didn't really go into depth about it because... You guys know, you guys have seen my videos a ton. Um, and then this right here is from Frank Hearts You, and you guys are gonna be like, whoa, 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 Chloe, what are you doing? <laughs> so I kind of talked about it when I got my, um, what's it called, when I got my mock planner. But basically what I wanna do is I wanna do mock monthly spreads for you guys in that planner to showcase other shops' monthly spreads. So I did pick up a June monthly spread from Frank Hearts Hue, and I know it's early because I won't do it until the end of June, but I saw this kit and I could not handle it. Like I needed this kit and I didn't wanna miss it. So this is the freebie and it says, if I were um, a macaroon, I would be a unicorn macaroon. That's really cute. I don't know what I'm going to put that on, but I'm going to put that on something. Um, and then the Be a Unicorn card, which I love this. You could turn this into a postcard or just keep it for yourself, which I'm probably going to do. But anyways, this is her monthly kit, and it's the adventure one for June. She had two options, and I did get the bigger one just because I figured I'm going to have more going on. Um, so, oh my goodness, what is this? June monthly, please use me to help conceal any dark text. Oh, that's cool. So this is like cut out so that you can put it behind these stickers so that there's, if there's anything dark behind it, it won't show through the sticker. That's pretty cool. And it's all like pre-cut for you too. That's awesome. I didn't know that was happening. Like that was coming with it, but that's pretty cool. Okay. Anyways, sidetrack. Now there's like a huge bubble in the middle of it. Okay. Fixed it. Anyways, so this is the top right corner and it like covers up the two rows and then this goes on the other side and it's like that marble with like all the what is this sundial kind of looks like a sundial but really love this and the colors and then these are boxes yeah all of these are boxes and then these look like sidebar items and then these are individual labels that you could use on each day and then you do have some headers over here for the boxes and then these are all the holidays so father's day summer starts ramadan ends and flag day and then on this sheet you have the flag and i don't know if this is for the new planner or if this is just like just cuz. But anyways, something that I really liked about Frank Hartsu kits that I didn't know about was that there's all of these icons and then all of these date cover-ups and you got all the paydays and then these are extra boxes and then this is an extra strip which I think could go over two days and then you do have all of these glitter strips to go off um, like if you want to cover up for like vacations or something like that. So I was really excited about that. 
And then this last sheet is a ton of just like, they're washi strips. Oh wait, what the, what are these? I guess these are washi strips too, but they're just like individual. Oh my goodness, this is gonna be so much fun to play with you guys, I don't think you understand. But you do have more labels up here and then like a half box type of thing. And then these you could totally use as labels too because they're just like solid color. So I'm very excited about this whole like mock monthly spread thing. I don't know how exciting it's going to be for you guys because it might be very similar, but I'm going to try and do something like, you know, a memory from each day or like what the big things were or something like that. And during the summer, I definitely have a lot more things that spontaneously happen. So I'm just, I'm very excited about that and I hope you guys are too. So along the lines of monthly this is actually an april one that i'm not going to record but i wanted to show you guys like i wanted to do a haul of the kit so that i could showcase the shop but i will show you the completed one of this in my may mock monthly spread if that makes sense and so i'm sorry that i'm not going to film this but i also need to kind of have a moment not like where I'm under pressure to like filming to kind of figure out how I want to do these. So this is from Paper Empire, which is a new shop to me, but um, I really, really liked her monthly kits and how they were all laid out. So I definitely wanted to give her a try. So I would definitely go check her out. But this is for April. So you have the top, like the top strips, and then you have some patterned quarter boxes. And then this reminded me a lot of Scribble Prints Co., but you have all of the little like square um, little event markers and then some more labels boxes and then the date dots and then these are more boxes and these I believe are the sidebar items because they kind of have lines in it and then you have some bigger boxes just tons and tons of options more boxes more like headers and labels and icons and then this is the washi to kind of cover up the days that aren't in April and then all of the holidays. So I'm very, very excited about using this kit and kind of figuring out how I'm going to do my monthly kits. So definitely go check out Paper Empire. She does have other monthly kits, which I was, you know, really tempted to get, but I wanted to kind of showcase different shops. And then this kit is from station stickers and this is her um pride kit and i'm so excited i got vinyl because i've decided that that's my favorite paper of hers it's vinyl matte and then glossy i don't know what it is about her matte paper but it's just so satisfying to peel off of the page that that's why it's my second um but she did add in this paper to kind of keep it all stable but it does have the very beautiful silver foiling on these two full boxes but I really do appreciate how simple these boxes are so I'm not going to mind covering them up if I have to but then you get all of your heart check boxes um, now this is all different so you do get three different colors of glitter headers the ombre uh, weekly box all of your box or half boxes and then your canceled and rescheduled stickers before you only got two glitter header options um but i'm excited that she kind of changed that up and then now you do get two flight trackers some icons which she didn't have before but you still have all of your little things and then your um date cover-ups and then over on this page you have your headers this is pretty much the same. The two habit trackers, weekend banner labels, and then her more like decorative icons. And then this is her washi sheet. So it does come with the little flags for the Erin Condren now over here. And then there are these really cool like arrow things. Can you see that? There you go. They're like arrows, which I thought was really nifty. I don't know how I'm going to use them, but it's always fun when people throw in things that kind of challenge you. So that is the pride kit from Station Stickers. And she does have them hole punched now so that you can put them in a binder. So if you use a binder system, all of her stuff is hole punched now. So yeah, I would definitely, it is a little bit more expensive. I think vinyl is the same price as glossy. So it is more expensive to get vinyl, but if you're not willing to pay the extra to get vinyl, I would definitely say get matte. I don't know what it is. It's just so satisfying. Um, I really love her matte stickers. So I don't need to put this back in there. Um, so that's, that's from Station Stickers. And then this is from Sponsored by Coffee. And fun story about this, Connie actually messaged me after, a little bit after I placed my order and was like, 
hey, um, so I know that you ordered your kit in matte, but I just opened my matte stickers and, I mean, my matte sticker paper and it's defective. And she was like, no extra charge, but I can upgrade you to glossy if you still want to get your order, you know, when I would send it to you if my matte paper wasn't defective. And so she was super sweet and upgraded my order to glossy paper so that I could get my order earlier. So thank you so, so much, Connie. That was super sweet. So definitely Sponsored by Coffee has great, great customer service, but this is the little freebie that came with it. I really love her Sponsored by, today's Sponsored by Coffee sticker. And then this is her simple kit, the Beach Palm Palm Beach Simple Kit. Um, she does have a bigger kit where the, um, full, my dog is barking, where the full boxes aren't cut and it does include a few more stickers, but I just got this because I'm going to use it in my inserts. So, um, first page you have your full boxes, but they're cut in the middle, and then you have some sidebar headers, and then you do have all of your headers and then little things and checklists. And then these come with sidebar items, date dots and date cover-ups, a few extra icons, washi strips and flags. And then you get two strips of bottom washi, which is fun in the inserts. You can do one side one pattern and the other side the other pattern. Some more washi strips and then all of your half boxes. So I really liked this pattern. It's very, very similar, if not identical, to the pattern in the Planning Roses kit. Um, so if you didn't get the vibe that I liked that pattern. Um, I do like that pattern. So I was excited to use this or to pick this up and use it in my inserts. Um, I don't know. It's probably going to be in the summer. I've been kind of gearing up to get more insert kits for the summer just because I've been finding so many kits that I just love and I want to use in my Erin Condren. So I've been needing to focus a little bit on my um, inserts. So this is from Magic Prince Co. And I had to place an order with her after I saw her do a plan with me with the kit that I picked up. I just was obsessed. So she does do the rewards program, which I have to put the little sticker on my other sheet. But I did get another gray freebie and I love those so much. Um, but I did get some, she was super nice and sent me a card. But she didn't do this on the last one or at least I didn't see it, but it says warning contents of this package are super cute. And I think that's adorable. And these are her like foiled stickers. So I did pick up two sheets of her foiled stickers because she's now got me hooked. I did get more of her um, Happy Mail stickers. I got them in silver this time and then I did get silver Yay It's Payday stickers because I thought both of these sheets were adorable and I wanted to have them in silver just because I feel like I use silver stickers a lot more. Um, but then this was the kit that I saw her use and it's her elegance kit and I got it in glossy because she hadn't changed up her paper yet. Now she offers glossy and, um, vinyl and I'm super excited to try her vinyl. I'm already like ready to place my next order, but her, um, her kit format is the same as my last order, so I'm just going to go quickly through it, but you have the freebie and then like the functional sheet. And then you have the sheet with all the headers and little things and then the date dots on the side. And then the heart checklists, the half boxes, sidebar items and quarter boxes. And then the mini icons, lettering stickers, more little things, um, label stickers and heart checklists. And then you have the... Um, full boxes and the bottom washi. So I was obsessed with this kit. Um, it actually really reminded me of my prom, my senior year prom. So I like wish I was planning and I wish that I used this kit, but now I'm going to find a special occasion to use that kit because I'm very excited about it. All right, guys, last order. And I guess it's not too long um, of a video. I thought it was going to be much, much longer, but this is also a new shop and this is from Knockout Prints Shop. And I picked up most of these stickers because of my work during the summer. I'm going to have a ton of dress up days and stuff that I need to remember. So that's why I got some very strange stickers. <laughs> and she was one of the only shops that I could find that had some of these stickers. And she actually has a ton of item stickers, stuff that I've never even seen before. And she has two different color patterns for both of the icon stickers. So... 
I would definitely suggest going and checking out her shop. She has a ton of stuff that I just would never even think of things that were a sticker. But anyways, this is her freebie on the front that has some of her designs on it. And then I got some of her hair stickers because I will have a crazy hair days and I thought it was just good to have some for when I go and get my hair done. And then I got car stickers because I've been needing these forever to mark carpooling and getting gas and whatnot, so I got those. And then I got these theater stickers for my more intense dress up days just because because I'm like, I'm not gonna find something on like, you know, action figure day. So <laughs> I just got these for those or when I have shows. And then I got the hangers as well for when I do have like pajama day or something like that, just another option for that. And um, like I said, there's the two different um, color patterns. So there's this one and then there's this one. So you can see this one's a little bit more on the neutral side and then this has some of the like, mixed in colors but she does have like color palettes on all of her um all of her item stickers so i'm gonna go ahead and lay everything out i have a ton of stuff to lay out so i'm just gonna pause the video and lay everything out and then i'll be right back to say goodbye to you guys all right guys so there is everything all laid out to show you guys all of the stuff that i got so i'm very very excited about all of my spreads that are coming up i'm feeling very motivated to just try new things and i know i've been talking about a lot about that but sadly when it comes to like videos and stuff you have to like really really plan things before they happen and it's kind of fitting that i'm a planner so <laughs> definitely be on the lookout for that all of the envelopes that all of this stuff came in just fell <laughs> but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below as always all of these links will be all of oh my goodness all of these shops will be linked down below and if i have any coupon codes they will be down there with the link so definitely use those codes because i would definitely want you guys to save money also a quick trick that i'm sure all of you know but if you go to a shop especially a new shop before you purchase from them like if you go to their instagram they usually have coupon codes and stuff in their um, bio on their Instagram. So I would definitely recommend doing that if you're ever going to try a shop for the first time. I know that I do that all the time and it's just fun to save some money, especially when you're not too sure about how much you're going to like a shop. But um, Paper Empire and Knockout Print Shop, I would definitely, definitely recommend checking out, especially Knockout Print Shop, just because all of her stickers are um, like icons and stuff and I just like I never thought that people would have those icons and I found a ton that I like that are applicable to me so definitely check out all these shops like I said um, and I will see you guys in my next video bye guys